showtime. Hi, I'm Tina Martin. Alice on the bat. Nice to meet you. Please, come in. You can see the living room has good dimensions, plenty of space, fireplace, hardwood floors. Isn't the asking price awfully low for a house like this? It is very reasonable. That's because it's a bank foreclosure. Those are the best deals, you know. I'm sure somebody is going to swoop in and steal this place. But this house has been for sale for three years. I just got the listing from the bank last week. In fact, you are the first person I'm showing it to, which could be very lucky for you. Oh, I love your shoes. And this is the den. It would make a lovely office for you or your husband. Did you say you were married? I've been searching for something in this neighborhood for some time. And the other day while I was looking, I heard a funny story about this house. Oh, well, this neighborhood is full of history, simply full of history. Apparently, it was owned by a young couple. It was their dream house. They couldn't really afford it, but somehow they managed. There are two bedrooms upstairs. The wife was so happy. But of course, it was too good to be true. After a few months, the husband was in this terrible car accident. <sighs> This one has a beautiful view, don't you think? He languished for months in the hospital before he died. Ate up all the insurance money, everything they had. Of course, it would make a wonderful nursery. The wife became so depressed, she was confined to a wheelchair. The bank foreclosed on the mortgage. Where did you say you heard this? They repossessed the house. But the wife, she swore, She'd never let anyone else live there, ever. Look, maybe this house just isn't right for you. <laughs> Finally, the marshals came. They broke down the front door. They searched nothing until they got to the bathroom. That's where they found. Found what? Miss Labatt? Miss Labatt? Is anybody here? Miss Labatt? Miss Labatt? Are you in there?
Jack Riley. Alice in the back. Nice to meet you. Please, come in. 